Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the impossible Pokemon quiz. I guarantee if you're watching this video, there is a 0% chance you'll get even half of these correct. We're back at it, and today we have LRXC doing the quiz. If you guys don't know, LRXC is a Gen 3 enthusiast, and of course the champion of the Battle Factory. And uh, yeah, let's get into it. Alright everyone. Due to a lot of requests, we're doing this again with the 20 question impossible Pokemon trivia. And I have someone special with me, and this is LRXC. As some of you guys know, LRXC is the current um, world record holder for the Emerald Battle, Battle Factory. So most of these questions will be Gen 3 related. Do you want to say anything, LRXC? Yeah, I saw you do the quiz with Dom before. Maybe I can get a better score. I'm just excited to see how little I know about anything that isn't Gen 3. And yeah, let's just do it. Fun stuff. Let's go. Okay. So question number one. From Ruby and Sapphire to Emerald, how many Pokemon sprites were changed? Oh, this is a good one. Okay. So from Ruby to Sapphire to Emerald, how many sprites were changed? I did not know that any were changed. Let me really think about this. Um, okay, so that means that it probably, I'm gonna say it's probably not any like, I'm gonna say it's probably not any like Kanto or Johto Mons because I feel like it would only be the main 200. Well, it could be some Kanto. Man, hold on a second, what? It's, so it, it's a, It's. I'm not saying who, it's a quantity. Yeah, it's a quantity. Man. Like, I feel like it's zero, but I don't think you would have asked this question if the answer was zero. So I really got to think, who did they change from Ruby Sapphire? I don't think Deoxys existed in Ruby Sapphire. Who did they change? Um, well, it's not a who, it's a how many. How many? Yeah. Like, I don't even, there's no way this is over five. I don't think so. You know, I don't know who, but I'm going to go with three. That is incorrect. How many? Five. But no way! Yeah, okay, so tell me tell, tell me who. So Snorlax is a big one. So, I was going to I was little I, I was thinking Snorlax is one of them, okay. Yeah, and the other changes are like minuscule. So basically War Turtle goes from like blue to like a bluish purple in Emerald. Oh that makes sense. I always think it's a shiny when I see it in the factory. Yeah, Jinx goes from like dark purple to like slightly lighter purple even though it's like minuscule okay and then like another one is lickitung because in I... ruby and sapphire lickitung is actually smiling in emerald it loses that smile surprisingly really yeah wait a second what okay then who's the fifth I don't remember who the fifth one is. Wow, no way. I'm looking at it now. It is, it's like smiling more in Ruby Sapphire. That looks bizarre. Yeah. Wow. All right. Hey, you got me there, but hey, now I know. The Lickitung thing, this is a goofy one. I like that little fact. All right. All right. Let's see the next one. Yeah. Okay. In generation three, how many moves can Alakazam learn? How many? Okay, wow. And I'm saying this right okay. now. Um, all the hidden power types, are, I'm just counting them as one because in game, hidden power is only yeah. really one type. Okay, let me let me let me really think about this. Okay, psychic, psi beam, confusion, uh, roll play, kinesis, T punch, ice punch, fire punch, focus punch. Okay, counter, T wave, um, future sight, recover. I, I don't think it learns psi wave. I'm pretty confident this thing doesn't learn psi wave. Um, did they give it shadow ball? Wait a second. No, oh, they did. They did because I saw it in ADV draft once. They gave it shadow ball. It gets knockoff. I know it gets knockoff. I know it gets encore. I know it gets calm mind. Um, okay, sure. We'll say hidden power. Um, I know it's not like a very stellar list of moves this thing gets. It learns Thief, because I know Abra in ADV Little Cup has used Thief before. Um, man, what else? What else? What else? What else? You know it gets Barrier, ADV 1v1 set. Um, Light Screen. Oh, does it even get screens? 
it has to get screens. It has to get light screen reflect. It gets confused. Wait, does it get confused, Ray? Pretty sure it does. I know it gets trick. There's one. Uh, Cause that's, uh, oh, it gets trick. It gets disable. Um, and there has to be some like really bad normal moves that this thing learns. I mean, there, there has to be, I mean, like, maybe I'm wrong though. Oh, it probably gets flash. I'm going to say it gets flash. Uh, yeah, pretty sure it does not get Psy Wave. I know it doesn't get Hypnosis. Yeah, Light Screen Reflect doesn't get Memento, doesn't get Destiny Bond. Yeah, Future Sight, Kinesis, Role Play. Role Play's a funny one. Um, does it get Mediate Meditate? No, it doesn't get that. Dude, I know, I know I'm missing something. It, I mean, it has to get more physical moves than just Focus Punch Shadow Ball. It, it probably learns, like, okay, okay, Protect. Sure, fine, Protect. Um, it learns double team. Yep, there's double team. Um, it should learn secret power. Every mod learns secret power, I'm pretty sure. Should get... Should learn toxic. Learns toxic. Learns substitute. There you go. Toxic substitute. Dude, there's... I know there's something. It doesn't... I gave it T-Punch, Fire Punch, Ice Punch. It doesn't get Mind Reader. It doesn't get Foresight. It doesn't learn, like, a weird recovery move besides Recover. I mean, okay, sure, rest. Okay, fine, rest, sleep, talk, snore. That's everybody. There, oh, Iron Tail, it learns Iron Tail randomly. I do know this. Wait, is that, does it? No, it does, because of a Cadaver's tail. So it learns Iron Tail. Um, does it get like Razor Wind? Oh, maybe it gets like, does it get like Leer or like Tail Whip? I'm thinking of like, I feel like it gets Body Slam. It does get Body Slam. It does, it does? Yeah. Okay, you're, you're giving me that one. Okay, body slam. This thing doesn't learn tack. Oh, teleport, duh. Cap Abra does that all the time. Um, what else does it learn like early on? I think it's literally just teleport and then it's just kind of like, haha, deal with this. Um, okay, you know what? Just for the sake of time, I think it's 36. I like the thought. I really enjoyed the thought process, but that's incorrect. How many is it? 61. What the? What did I miss? So you missed, I missed Facade, those... Double Edge, uh, Hyper Beam. There's a lot of physical stuff. Did you say I mean, Future looking, Sight? I'm, yeah, I did. I'm looking at this right now. How many did I miss? Yeah, okay, Seismic I missed, Toss. I missed, I missed Facade. Oh, oh yeah, Frustrate, duh, Facade, Frustration, Return. Okay, that's like three easy ones. Double Edge, yeah, that's four. Um, seismic Toss, yeah, that's five. Ah, Taunt. Taunt is six. Oh, Attract is seven. Dream Eater, eight. Dynamic Punch, nine. Wow, yeah, that's nine. Endure, okay, 10, sure. Hyper Beam, yeah, 11. Mega Punch, Mega Kick, Metronome, Mimic, Nightmare. Wow, yeah, I missed all of those. Psych Up, there is no way. Yeah, Shockwave, Torment, Swagger. Yeah, I mean, I could have, if... yeah, that's interesting. Yeah, that's, you know, that's kind of interesting. Mons learn a lot more moves than I really give them credit for because I thought I was maybe like 10 or like 11 off. But yeah, there's a lot of stuff that you don't really realize Mons learn. That's kind of sick. Yeah. I'm ha I'm very proud of myself that I got Iron Tail though. That was a sick find by me. Iron Tail is pretty um, cool though. Yeah. All right. My bad. All right. Keep going. Keep okay. Going. <laughs> Question number three. How long is Rayquaza? How long? Yeah. These white, I mean, the, uh, not white, height. These white, height. Why do I keep saying white? These height class, these height questions. Um, I have, I have absolutely no clue, but I mean, it has to be, this thing is really long. I don't know, 40 feet. That is incorrect. 100, 100. That's still incorrect. What is it? 23. So only 23 feet long? Yeah, well, I'm pretty sure, um, the Rayquaza, base Rayquaza is like one of the tallest Pokemon in general. So, there's not wow, really a lot of tall Pokemon. 22 feet? Yeah, 23. I thought, Rayqua I thought this thing, I thought this thing was way bigger. Wow, okay. Yeah. Well, you got me there, all right, let's, let's keep going. What okay, other... question four is a special one because it's actually related to the Battle Factory. Oh, I, okay, I better not get this one wrong, let's see. Okay, question number four. What moves does Dragonite 9 have in the Battle Factory? Oh, you absolute monster. I have not played open level enough to know Dragonite 9. Um, wow, you really picked a stretchy one. Yeah, because I've, I've done so much level 50 stuff. 
Um, okay. So... So for this one, I, I, if you lay off... You have to give me like four new moves, but I'll tell you which ones are correct or incorrect. Yeah, all right. So I am pretty sure that this is not one of the four attacking Dragonites because I think that is Dragonite five through seven or six through eight, where it's like that D-claw, flamethrower, surf kind of thing. I think you, you probably picked a really quirky Dragonite, and I think Dragonite nine is a definitely a quirky one. I don't think it is the Dragon Dance... I don't think it is the Dragon Dance Hyper Beam T-Wave Attract set. I don't think it's that one. I think that one is Dragonite. No, maybe it... No, you know what? I think this is, um... Is this, uh... We're gonna go with Dragon Dance Hyper Beam Rest Attract. The final answer? Yeah, we're gonna do that one. That is incorrect. Oh my gosh, which one is it? So, Dragonite 9 has Thunder, Surf, Rain Dance, and Earthquake. Ah! It's the Weather Dragonite. Yeah, wow, I look like a fraud right now. I have not I have not experienced a Dragonite enough because it's in level 100, and then you only see it... Well, no, you do see it early, but you only see Dragonite 9 on rounds 5 and later. I gotta do more level 100 singles. Yeah, it's so it's that... It's that which one was I thinking? Ah, uh, I was thinking of uh, D-Knight 4. Yeah, darn. Yeah. Okay, anyway... Okay. I was right though. Six to eight is the the all four attack ones. Anyway, all right. Yeah. Okay. Question number five. How much is Cradilly's special attack stat? Oh wow. I should know this. Um, it's not very good at all. It's not. It's definitely. It is definitely not over one hundred. Almost confidently not over ninety. I think it's like a weird odd number. I think I think it's a weird odd number. I don't think it's a flat. I don't think it has a zero or a five. I think it has a three at the end of it. I think it's 83 special attack. You were so close. You were no like, way. it's 81. Oh, I knew it was an odd number at the end of it. And I knew that it was not a flat number. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> well, I've okay. gotten zero right. All right, let's go. Yeah, in gen three, what level does Slack King get Sleep Talk? It learns it on level up? Wow. Yeah, I don't know a lot about level up moves. Okay, wow. What, when does it learn? So I know it gets... Wow. It learns Sleep Talk on level up. That's a kind of a little... That's a fun fact. Um, dang. Well, okay, so it has to be after 30s, 5 or something when it evolves. Um, I think... Wow, that's fascinating. When does it learn sleep? I'm gonna go with like 55. That's incorrect. What is that? Okay, this is an evil <laughs> question, but is it? It's an what ink is move. This? Oh my god! How am I, dude? You <laughs> asked what level it is. Yeah, if you an straight up move? said it doesn't learn sleep talk, I would have given it to you by level up. It's an egg move. Yeah, sleep talk is an egg move. Wow, I'm looking at it right now. Oh, it doesn't even learn anything at level 55. That was kind of a. Wow, it's a egg move from the Whismur line. Wow, that's bizarre. So it can't, it just can't learn. That's really weird that it just can't learn sleep talk. Wow, interesting. Yeah. Funny. All right, let's see what's next. Okay. So question number seven. In Pokemon Emerald, what is Pokemon number 83 in the regional decks? Wow, my, what I thought Cradley's special attacks that was. Um, in the regional deck? So like this won't involve... Kanto, yeah. Johto, right? Yeah, only the Hoenn regional decks. So, I think the Hoenn regional decks has 202 Pokemon, 200 minus yeah. Jirachi and Deoxys. Yeah. 83. Let me think. Um, 83. Okay, well, like, no, I mean, no, no. So, yeah, it, it definitely has, there's some Kanto, Johto mods in there. 83. Okay, I feel like you, you you probably picked a Pokemon that's like, ooh, it's forgettable. Do you want a so hint? Like, I'm... Yeah, give me a hint. It's a Kantomon. Oh, wow, that's lame. Uh, I was going to say something like the Brava, but let's see, Kantomon. Um, Kantomon at 83. A Kantomon that you just casually encounter in the game that would be like, kind of like mid-late game? I'm trying to think about like in that 
area by Falarber Town, right? You got like that Altaria, you got the Trope, not the, you got the Altaria, so Viper stuff there, the Spinda stuff there. It's not Skarmory, it's gonna be like, uh... I mean, damn, is it coughing? No, incorrect. What is it? It's Magneton. Magneton, okay. Yeah, because no clue. I've noticed this, but like, Pokemon, you fight um, earlier in the game, show up earlier in the regional deck, so guys like Altaria and guys like those, they'll show up later in the decks because you fight them. You technically encounter them later. Yeah, I was thinking coughing because you can get it in that little, uh, well, I think you can catch ca coughing in that, like that, that, uh, what do you call it? The, the area with like the flutes and the little ninjas and the spin does. But also, I think you can get it in that little, uh, that cave with the Torkoal and the uh, Machops and the, 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 like that, that, that lava mountain thing. I don't know. Yeah, um, coughing is anyway. 108. 108, all right, I was way off. Man, I gotta get one right. Let's go, come on, give me some more. So, we all know Ablog is your favorite Pokemon, right? Don't ask me how much it weighs. I feel it coming. How much does Hisuian Ablog weigh? Oh my gosh. I mean, dude, I have no clue. I'm gonna, I don't, like, are we going off of, like, pounds? Yeah, pounds. <sighs> 111. I have, I have absolutely no clue. Okay, that's <laughs> incorrect. I'm sorry. What is it? 578. Yeah, I have no clue. Does anybody actually sit down and look at the weights of Pokemon? I do. There's no way. All right, guys, in the comments below, let me know if you actually look at the heights and weights of Pokemon. Or no, 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 no. Other way around. Comment if you don't look at the heights and weights of Pokemon. I just got you more comments. There you go. Yeah, okay. I think one random fun fact I know, I think Croconaw and Wobbuffet have the same height and weight. I'm pretty sure I'm correct on that. Maybe I'm not. I don't know. Okay. Anyway. You so, guys can fact check me. Let's go. Question number nine is another weight question, but okay. Jesus Christ. In Pokemon Black and White, so you basically, you know, like when you send out a Pokemon, it does like that stomping ground effect. Yeah, sure. And like all the heavier Pokemon, like Metagross, Tyranitar. Um, That's most... only in Gen 5, right? Yeah, that, well, it's in like Gen 5 onwards, but in Gen 5, there's like. A minimal threshold for that like a pokemon to be like considered like super fat to get that like extra oh, animation yeah that's actually kind of cool yeah so how much is that minimal minimal weight threshold threshold in kilograms jesus christ okay yeah you really are making this impossible um i don't know like <sighs> i've 436 or no wait kilograms jesus i don't know 400 kilograms that's way off but let's go that's incorrect so what is it? 150 ah which equates that was to my like second guess that was my second guess about like 300 pounds i know this because like embor has that like animation and it weighs exactly 150 kilograms ah uh, so they probably used that as a metric because yeah. they wanted that effect for a starter. Okay. That's neat. Okay. Question number 10. How many water type Pokemon get the move Flamethrower? Okay. Is this bef is this Gen 3 and before or all Pokemon? All Pokemon. Because I know the only one in Gen 3 and before should be Octillery. Um, and then Ludicolo learning Fire Punch. Um, okay. Anyway. So, well, we got Octillery. Let's go. Um, I got it. Oh, no, I'm wrong. Gyarados does as well. Uh, Gyarados in Gen 1, Octillery in Gen 2. Are there any other random Gen 1 mons that learn Flamethrower? I don't think so. Water types, yeah. Starmie, no. Dugong, Lapras, Walrein, no. Um, yeah, Tentacruel, no. Kyogre, no. Marshtomp, Swampert, those things, no. Gorbis, Huntail, no. Relicant, no. <laughs> Oh, okay, and you know what? Get this. I'm gonna add one that you didn't even think about. Ready? Ready, guys? Cast form rainy. I'm a god. Anyway, um, <laughs> you didn't put that on that list. You didn't do it. I know you didn't. I know you didn't. I will. Anyway. I didn't. <laughs> I ah, ha, ha. <laughs> yeah, cast form rainy. 
And okay, so Garrett, you know, but we're gonna, I have to act like that isn't on the list. So I'll say Gyarados, Octillery. Um, okay, let's go to Gen 4 water types. You got like, damn, I don't know Gen 4 Mons. Who plays that game? No, I'm just kidding. Uh, it's a good, it's a cool thing. Gen 4 water type that learns flamethrower. There's no way. I don't think any of them do. I think none of them do. One of them does. I think zero. Oh, no, 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 no. Palkia does. Palkia does. Yeah, Palkia's um, one of them. Yeah, Pal one of them. There's another one? No, one of them on the list. So Palkia, yeah, just Pal I will say Palkia's the only one from Gen 4. Yeah, that's what I figured. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let's see. Gen 5 water types that could learn the move flamethrower. No, Volcanian's like Gen 6 or something like that, but I'm just going to put it down because, duh. Um, yeah, that's an easy one. What Water type that learns Flamethrower in Gen 5. I mean, like, what, you got, like, freaking, you got, like, Jellicent. I think, I don't think any, I don't think any Gen 5 ones do, so I'm going to move on. I might come back to it, though. Gen 6. Who even knows what Pokemon are in Gen 6? I don't. Okay, move I'll on. say right Gen now, 7. yeah, Volcanian's the only one from Gen 6. Yeah. Gen 7, okay, SM type of stuff. There's some quirky mons here. One one of them definitely learns Flamethrower. Let's think of the quirky water type in Gen 7 that learns Flamethrower. All right. Um, Civality does not Not Tapu Fini. Okay, yeah, Cast Form Rainy, though. <laughs> <laughs> That's such a sick thing by me. Anyway, um, okay, let me actually work backwards. Gen 9, any of these quirky mons learn Flamethrower? These bipedal looking things. Sarah Ledge is in a walk. Veluza definitely doesn't. How about like, uh, I don't know. What are some, dude, I sound such like a boomer right now. You guys, you guys, your audience is going to think this is hilarious. Um, Gen 9 water type that learns flamethrower. Where, who are you? You, you definitely, I feel like you exist somewhere. Oh, oh, walking wake. Ha, ah, that's one of them. Yep, that's, that's one of them. That's probably the only. That's probably the only Gen 9 one. I can't think of anything else that That is learn. the only Gen 9 one. Okay, so, okay, okay. So, I just, I want, I need to get a question right, and I think this is the one that I have the highest chance of getting right. So, I really got to dig in. Gen 8. Does Basket Legion... No, I'm getting in my head. All right, do you want so me just to gonna... give you a final hint? Sure, one more hint. The rest... The, I, the rest of them are in the... Are within the first three generations but i will say there's one gen That's where it. there are no um water types that learn flamethrower so you're saying there's another one in the first gens okay let's polywrath polywhirl gyarados i mean like blastoise definitely doesn't is there like a weird special mon in battle factory that gets that they gave flamethrower for some reason probably what there's another water type and Besides cast form rainy, um, or it's not for alligator. Oh, it's is it like a forgettable? No, I already did the forgettable Gen Two mon. Its name is Octillery. There's, is it Remoraid? No uh, way that thing learns flamethrower. It does learn flamethrower. It does. It's Remoraid. <laughs> yeah, but mother of God. I will say. Okay, I think there's what. There's still a few more you're, you're missing. There's a few more. Oh my gosh. Who, who, this, this, there's no way. You either, know, no it, you way. either know it or you don't. I don't think there's any more in Gen 1, 2, and 3 that learned this move. I, I can't, I can't see that being a possibility. I have no clue who would even, like, I don't know who would even come close to, I mean, definitely not Gen 3. There's no way there's, no, wait, I didn't say a Gen 3 Pokemon, and you're saying that there's one in Gen 3. Oh, I'm, what? okay, I will say right now there's none in Gen 3. That's the yeah, okay, that's okay, I, I knew that, come on, man. I don't think there's another Gen 1 water type that learns Flamethrower. I feel like I would have known about it. And I don't think there's one in Gen 2 unless it's like some super forgettable Gen 2 water type. So I think it would, it would ha I think Gen 8 is the culprit. Gen 8 is definitely the culprit. And I don't, it, it's Gen 8, right? There's a Gen 8 one. No. No, <laughs> oh, what? Did I have them all? Is it seven? Is that your final answer? Did... All right, you said, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with I'm going to go with seven, but I also declare that because I found one that you didn't, if it's eight, then I'm also correct. So I'm going to say, I get to say seven slash eight. The, okay. Both of those are wrong because it's nine. Oh my G. Who? I'm the, looking this up right the now. The slow poke Who? line. Oh no. 
All three of them, I bet, right? Yep, all three of them. Oh my gosh, who gives who gave Slowpoke Flamethrower? Oh, darn it, man. <laughs> so I was right that there's none in Gen 7 then. I was right on that. Yeah, yeah. Wow. I'm sorry I'm taking so long, but this is kind of it. Okay, go on. I'll give you half a point. I, I think I deserve half a point for saying Cast Form Rainy. Because I, when I was looking through it, I wasn't counting um, the Arceus or Savali forms. And I totally I think about cast form. I think Cast Form is different, though, because it is it is still like it, it is some it, it's still a cast form. Well, I guess I guess it's kind of a weird thing, but I think Cast Form Rainy is funny. I think that was a great answer by me. Yeah, anyway. Yeah. OK. Hi there. Real quick, if you're enjoying this video, make sure to subscribe as less than 2% of people who actually watch my videos are subscribed. And double check to make sure you've subscribed to the channel as you may think you're subscribed while you're actually not. So yeah, subscribe. Anyways, back to the video. So we're on question number 11. So Jesus, okay, come on. I gotta get one of these, okay. let's go. How, how much of an increase does Magikarp get to its base stat total when it evolves? into Gyarados. Oh my god. Um oh, wow. Um if I recall correctly, my Lodic and Gyarados have the same base stat total. That doesn't help me though, because I have no clue what my Lodic's base stat total is. So I think it's I mean, I don't 545 think, or 540. I think it's like I was gonna say 530. I think I think it's 530. Might be 530, 540. So Magikarp, I don't think Magikarp has a flat stat line, like, you know, like a Spinda or a Glalie or a Cast Form. I think Magikarp has some variety with it, but I don't think it's very good. I'm gonna, you know what? I'm just gonna say 320. Holy, you are very close. No way. It's 340. Oh, what? So wait, let's see. Let's see. I'm looking at Showdown now. Let's see if I go Gyarados is... Is it, it, was I right? Is it 530? It's 540. 540. Ah, you were right. So then Magikarp is just a, oh, it's a flat 200. Wow, yeah. Huh. The flat 200. I knew it wasn't a flat thing. Wow, it has five more special attack than attack. That's cool. 80 base speed? I didn't realize Magikarp was this fast. Anyway. Surprisingly. All right. Okay. Yeah, okay. All what right. else do we got? Okay, so question number 12. There are two Pokemon known as the armor Pokemon. What are they? Oh my gosh. Okay, so I know one is, I know one is before Gen 3 because I've seen armor Pokemon on the tagline when I, if I as I've drafted something for Battle Factory. It has, there, I think, so I know it's not Metagross because Metagross is the first Paradox Pokemon, the Iron Leg Pokemon. <laughs> True. The armor Pokemon. Oh. Fortress is screaming at me, but I don't think it's Fortress. I think it, it, it could totally be Tyranitar, but like armor. Okay, I will say right now, Tyranitar is one of them. Okay, it is Tyranitar. Okay, so Tyranitar, and then uh, they probably gave it to some lame Pokemon like Armor Rouge. It, it, if it's Armor Rouge, there's, please, I hate that Pokemon so much. There's no way it's Armor Rouge. It has to be like, it's definitely not Empoleon. That's like, it's not Empoleon. It's not. It's not Bastiodon. It's not. I mean, it's not Agron. It's like. What is like a very armored Pokemon? What's something that is outfitted with armor? And why would they repeat it? So I don't think it's like. I don't think it's like Gen 3, Gen 4. It's probably like they forgot that there was another armor Pokemon. Okay. I'll give you um, a hint. It's, a, it's also Gen 2 Mon. Oh my god. If it's Pupitar, I quit. It's not Pupitar. It's not it's, Pupitar. Uh, well, it's not Fortress. You would have told me it's Fort. It better not be Fortress. It's not Fortress. But it's not Fortress. Yeah. Okay. A, an armor Pokemon. I don't think it's Shuckle. There's so many forgettable Gen Two Pokemon. Yeah, because um, most of them suck. Oh, oh no! There's no way it's Skarmory. There's no way. Is it Skarmory? No. What? It's like zero Gen 2 Pokemon. Who else can it be? Is it like a... Uh... Man, I really don't think it's Mag Cargo. I really don't think it's Mag Cargo. 
Um, an armor Pokemon in Gen 2? There's like five Gen 2 Pokemon that matter. Um, oh, is it Scizor? No. What? Oh my gosh. Gen 2 Pokemon, that's the... It, this is probably dumb. It's probably something stupid. It's probably something that doesn't make sense because Gen 2 doesn't make sense. It's not Gligar. It's not like Yanma. It's not Corsola. It's not Sneasel. It's not like... <laughs> Dude, there's no... Dude, how is it not Fortress? That's ridiculous. There, dude, that's like the... Oh, is it Steelix? No, that's the Iron Snake, isn't it? Yeah, it's the Iron Snake. No. Yeah, that's not Steelix. Dude, there's like no Steel types left. That's literally all of them. Is it? I'm trying to think. Wait a second. It's a Gen 2 Pokemon. Who exists in Gen 2 that matters? Stantler? Definitely not Stantler. Um... I don't know. Just tell me. Let's expedite this. What is it? It's Donphan. Don Dude, that thing has... Oh, my gosh. How is that not like the elephant or something? Like, what? Oh, my gosh. Yeah, but since you got T-Tar, I'll give you half a point. All right. Well, half a point plus cast form is one point. So I got a question right. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, this... You know, you know what? This really makes sense. So Fanpy is the long nose Pokemon. I love Gen 2. I love Gen 2. Anyway, let's go on. Oh, Fortress is the bagworm Pokemon. That's right. Anyway. Okay. So, okay. Question number 13. In 2007 and 2008, there's a Deoxys distribution being held in the Generation 4 games. What item was it holding? Oh my gosh. Um, This item was introduced in Gen 2. Oh, okay, I'm gonna put one out, okay. Is it the Berserk Gene? Okay, I'll give you, it's not the Berserk Gene because the Berserk Gene was Gen 2 only, but I'll give you one more shot. Okay, I, I was kind of thinking, I was like, I thought that was Gen 2 only. Okay, okay, so it's a Gen 2 item. Okay, but there's a lot of items that only exist in Gen 2, like those weird berries. What's one that, like, what would they get? What, what, why would they give Deoxys a Gen 2 item? What's like a good Gen 2 item? Like, a really trying to. Man, I don't know. What is it? What is it? It's the Never Melt Ice. Never Melt? Why? I don't know. It's like so random. You got me there, yeah. I didn't even... I thought Never Melt Dice was a Gen 3 item. I didn't even know it was Gen 2. Okay, question number 14. You either know this or you don't. On Hoenn oh, Route God. 129, how many Feebas towels are there? Uh, five. That's incorrect. Is it six? It's six. Oh my... I hate everything. <laughs> I knew it was like five to six. I knew it was like five to six. Okay, go on. Okay, question number 15. Okay. There is an ability that was supposed to be added in Generation 3, but in never Cacophony. did. Cacophony. That is correct. Got him. <laughs> I knew that one. Yeah, Cacophony was supposed to be x ability. Yeah. Speaking of Got abilities, it. question number 16. How many were added in Gen 3, not including um, Cacophony? Literally every single Do I really? Okay, I really have to name every single ability. All right, here no, we go. No, not every you single ability. Just this. give me the number. <laughs> You, nope, you, I mean, you asked for this, here we go. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, I don't know. I mean, like, I could, like, name every ability right now, probably, but, like... It's between 70 and 90. Okay, 82. Incorrect. Yeah, so 76 abilities were added in Gen 3. Well, I, that's such a, that's a weirdly phrased question, because it's just, like, uh, their abilities were added in Gen 3, and there happened to be... 76 of them or whatever there there are anyway go on question number 17 when did pokemon xd come out in japan oh my god i don't know who the like 2005 i don't know so i'm looking for the exact date but it the, did come out in 2005 you're, you're looking for the exact date. there are zero people in this that are watching this video this far into the video that know the date of pokemon xd and if you do uh, I don't know. You don't. You don't. If you do, you don't. Yeah, it did so, come out in 2005. Know, February, February 23rd. February 23rd, 2005. It, incorrect, but I'll give you half a point for getting the year right. Oh. It came out August 4th, 2005. Ah, uh, that was my seventh guess. <laughs> All right, let's go. Okay. 
this is another weight question. I'm I'm at, I'm leaving the call. It's if not another weight question. question. You, you skip you skip it right now, man. This better not be a, how how heavy is Totodile? <laughs> <laughs> it's not another weight qu question. I promise. Okay. What Pokemon currently has the most top eight appearances in the Pokemon World Championships, and it's not Incineroar. No, no, I figured. So you're, you're talking about every single VGC? Yes. Not uh, counting, how... like, Ori Coliseum. Okay, even though there was real VGC turn. So, like, yeah. Gen 4 and above. Or is it, no, Gen 5 and ahead, right? Yeah, Gen 5. It's not, yeah, I mean, it doesn't make sense that it, it has to be Yaman that is... Is this, you said regionals or nationals? World, um, the World Championships. Oh, World Champions. Okay, so there's not that many of these. Um... I mean, it, it has to be Gen. It has to be an iconic mon from Gen Five or Gen Six. I really don't. And you said Top Eight, right? Yeah. Okay. It's not Incineroar. It's got. It's got to. It's got to be. My top two ideas right now are Indorosterian and Amoongus. Those are my two big ideas because they came out in Gen Five. They've been dominant Pokemon all the time. But then again, by the time it's worlds it's usually like unga bunga legendary stuff i don't think it's a legend is it a legendary it or is like a legendary. like, like a it's not a box legendary right it's not a, it's not a box legendary all right you you emphasized box which means it's a legendary i'm gonna go with i'm gonna i'm gonna go with landorus you were close is it tornadus it's thunderous but really yeah I would not have thought Thunderous. I, I, I knew it was a genie. It had to be a genie, but I would not have thought of Thunderous. That 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 shocks me. How, how when, what Thunderous over Landorus? That's crazy. That's literally, I'm pretty sure Thunderous did win the 2022 World Championships. I think it did cop, top cut last year, but Thunderous uh, was everywhere in Gen 5 EGC because of Prankster Thunder Wave. Prankster Thunder Wave was pretty broken, so. Yeah, makes sense. Yeah. So we're on question right. number 19. So this is a dex entry, and you have to give me the Pokemon's name. Okay. Oh, it said Jesus that Christ. this Pokemon grew ferocious because people in times long past loathed it, considering it to be evil incarnate, and attacking it, it were relentlessly. What Pokemon is it? Is this like, can you give me a gen? Because there's zero Gen chance. 5. Gen 5, and then repeat it. What is it? Um, repeat the dex entry? The, the, the de yeah, the dex entry. Okay. It said that this Pokemon grew ferocious because people in times long past loathed it, considering it to be evil incarnate and attacking it in attacking it re relentlessly. Oh my God, I cannot say that word. Relentlessly. Yeah. Little angry feller. Long past, that makes me think fossil, but I don't think think it's like it's not a fossil i'm pretty sure yeah it's not arcan or archaeops it's probably like uh you know i'm gonna go with like uh i'm gonna go with carablast carablast uh, are you sure <laughs> okay it's not carablast let me re i knew it wasn't carablast i'm gonna rethink so just a, a troubled mon from the past uh it's probably i don't think it's Kofa Grigus. There's no way it's Kofa Grigus. I'm it, thinking like it's not Co it's not um Kofa Grigus. And it's not it's definitely not Carablast. It's, de it's definitely not unless you are really psyching me out for no reason. It's a hundred percent not Carablast. I will say it is a hundred percent not Carablast. Um man an old like this dude got bullied a lot when he was back in the day who got bold what what gen 5 mine would get bullied i hope it would be the monkeys because i hate those monkeys but it's definitely that's definitely not their dex entry um a bullied little guy i'm gonna go with be, became ferocious what's a ferocious little animal what's a what's just like a little little piranha chihuahua thing at your heels all the time do you um, want me to give you one more hint yeah give me a hint it's a final evolution Evolution. No way it's crocodile. I think it's ferocious. This thing is for I mean it does have anger point. It could be crocodile. But I don't think so. I, I don't think that would that doesn't make sense because it's not really ferocious. It's just kind of like cool. 
Is, I wonder, is Darmanitan considered, like, really, really angry? Is it Darmanitan? Is that your guess? And it, yeah, I'm gonna go Darmanitan, because it has a Zen mode, so I think it would, like, contrast that. Alright, it's incorrect. Oh my god, who is it? It's Hydragon. Who? You don't- Hydragon? Oh, Hydragon. Oh, well, okay. Yeah. Why wouldn't they have one about its heads? That's bizarre. Each of its three heads has a different... So, I don't know. Anyway. basically, um, I was looking at the dex entries, and most of them were referring to its three heads. So I had to look for a dex, for a dex entry that did not mention its three heads, because I knew you would get it. This really is the 99.9999999% of you. I, I, you know, I think it's just zero. I don't, you probably didn't have a single person that got your quiz right last time. Zero percent chance. Okay, final question. question this better not 20. be a weight question. SMB, I swear to it God. It is not a weight question. question. You, you better Google up another one right now. If this is weight, if this is height, <laughs> if this is like, I don't even know, like, guess how many kids... Hat rat had five years ago? No, I don't want that. <laughs> All right, question number 20. What was the first ever shiny Pokemon event distribution? Oh my god. Okay, well, it has to be Gen 2, I would think. Um... All right, I'll say right now it's Gen 3. It's Gen 3? Yep. Okay, shiny event distribution in Gen 3. Um, specifically shiny... Ugh. And they had to have given it a move. I, I don't know if it's um, I don't think it's a um, I don't think it's like Wish Mints. I don't think it's Wish Shell Gone. I because then it would have to be shiny in Emerald. This has to be something. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Actually, 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 hold on. Wait a second. Well, I know shiny Zapdos can't have Baton Pass, but I don't think it would be anything relating to Zapdos. Probably just some like weird Mon. But I'm a suit. I would hope it's Gen Three related. It is Gen Three related. It's a Gen Three Pokemon. Yeah, I don't think it's. I don't think Lanoon had to be shiny to have that E speed. Um, I have no. I'm really trying to. Who would they like? Get, who who has like a cool shiny that they'd want to show off? You know what? I'm gonna go way out there. I'm gonna go way out there. I don't think it's this, but I give up. Masquerade. That's incorrect. Who is it? It's Zigzagoon. <laughs> oh my God! It was the E speed Zigzagoon. Are you kidding me? I think so. I think it had E speed. For it, it's shiny, no it way! Was, it's the e, I might be wrong e on this because. Oh it, wait, I'm dumb because you can you can breed it. You can't breed Zapdos, right? Yeah, you can breed it. Oh, so the wild. six Sigun was basically for the berry glitch, and it, if you patch the berry glitch, they would give you a shiny six Sigun. Re uh, the the pomeg the glitz are popping. Yeah, the berry glitch. For gen, for the, oh, or just the general, just the general berry glitch. Yeah, it was for general, and like it was like an in-person event, so not a lot of people know about it. Wow, yeah, I'm trying to find anything about this on Bulbapedia, I guess. Like, wow, that's kind of bizarre. Well, I got all these wrong. This quiz sucks. I mean, it is called the Impossible Pokemon Quiz. Damn. Yeah, this was this was uh. This was definitely an impossible Pokemon quiz. All right, guys, how heavy is Delcaddy? Shiny Delcaddy. How heavy is Shiny Delcaddy? At least you got the Cacophony one, right? Yeah, I got I got the Cacophony one right away. I knew I knew that. I had that one on lock. I had that one on lock. Yeah, and I did enjoy the the Alakazam thought process. Yeah, I had a lot more off, but yeah, I got Iron Tail Alakazam. I'm feeling I'm pretty feeling pretty good about Iron Tail Alakazam. Yeah, it, it was good having you. Do you want to say anything before we end this video? Yeah, um, if you guys like Pokemon, I have a big Pokemon channel. It's almost at 26k subscribers. You guys should subscribe if you're watching this far, all right? Number two, um, if you're watching this far, to prove that you're watching this far, you have to comment Cast Form Rainy in the comment section. This is something you have to do. And uh, that's all I got. Anyways, that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to subscribe to the channel, subscribe to LRXC, like the video, and comment down below how many questions did you get right. Check out these videos right here, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.